Hi there, I welcome you to Expo Hub channel. In case you have not subscribed to our channel, please do subscribe. We are into exercise number 12 and let's understand what is this task. In this exercise, you have been given a list of string, okay, which has got different names. If you look at, at the image, James, Mark, Anson, Robert, so you can have some four or five names. And after that, your job is to simply short the names in ascending order and descending order. So that is the exercise. Okay. And on top of that, post you short it either in ascending or descending, right? Show in a message box the top three data only. So let's say you have got four data or five data. You have to only show the top three data in a message box. Okay. So how to do that? We are going to learn. So you can pause the video and do it on your own. This is a simple exercise. I am pretty sure you will be able to do it. Do it on your own. Only when you need help, you can proceed further to the video just to check what I have done and how I have done. Okay. So please mark yes once you have completed this exercise and please do click on subscribe for more such contents people who have not subscribed to our channel. Okay. With that, let's get started. Now the first thing I have to have a variable. Okay. Um, so let me have a variable created. Okay. So you can see the variable I have created and I have given certain names. So this is quite simple. I have told you how to create a list and how do you enter data so that I have done it, which is very pretty simple. Okay. In case you wanted to have a check. Okay. How it is written new list of string from this is one way or else you can just initialize it new list of string and leave it um, uh, and, and then in the curly braces you can just keep it blank uh, or you don't have to write from uh, right even that is another way and use assign activity you can add the names so there is another way okay uh, either you do it in the default or using an assign activity so once your list is declared okay so once it is declared all i have to do is i have to use something called invoke method activity and simply write the target object the name of that one is names okay so i have written that and i am simply writing method name as sort okay so if i do short um, so how do you see the data so i have told you several in the several exercises this is one thing that we have clearly learned string dot join right which is pretty helpful and then we put a double quote put a comma right and then write if it is a array or a list or dictionary uh, anything right just to see what kind of data it contains I can write it this way okay so once I have written this let me simply run it so what would happen now all this name James Mark Anson robot all these names supposed to get shorted I have added in the name Bobby so uh, so now you can see all the names has been shorted as per the alphabet now the next thing how do I reverse it okay how do I reverse it so for that let me use invoke method okay so the data is shorted already now what I will do with that data I will simply say names and I am going to say the method name as reverse so what would happen reverse is just reversing it it's not actually this shorting it in descending order so once you have shorted in um, A to Z right uh, you have shorted the names and then it is going to reverse that whatever is there at the last it will come bring it to the front uh, like that it will do so let me run it so I'm using two different methods. Okay. If you're doing only one method and writing reverse, what would happen is the way you have written is going to show it um, in, in just reverse, which is not going to short it. Okay. So now you can see it appears like it has been shorted, but it's just in reverse of what is being done in the short. Short has shorted it from A to Z. And this is just doing a reverse. This is not actually shorting in descending manner. Okay. Have a understanding of this. Now the another question is I need to have 0 to 3 the first top 3 or top uh, 2 uh, data okay top 2 or top 3 data so how do I do it so for that um, instead of writing names okay so this list is containing 
all, all the all the, all the data right so i want only first two data or first three data so for that what i will do i'll simply write get range okay this is another syntax that you have to make a note get range make a note in a paper i'm i'm suggesting you from all the exercises right so make a note of the syntaxes 0 comma 3 okay 0 comma 3 or 2 whatever you need so let's say 2 okay so this way it is going to give you only the top data so it is your list is shorted in the index right 0 1 2 3 so it is going to pull only the particular data and show it to you so let's quickly run it so the same thing you can apply it for the sort so this is what you have to make a note note get range okay okay so now you can see it has shown two data starting from the index zero and two data so if you need three then you can say three okay so robot mark has come as the two data you need three then answer three so this is what one of the simple and easy quick learning that we have on shorting the list or shorting the even you can apply it for the array all right guys thank you so much we'll come up with the next exercise bye bye